does your player blueprint look something along the lines of this? Well, let me help you with that. So in this video I'm gonna quickly show you how you can sort out your variables a little bit more so they are a bit more tidy and you are more effective when working with them. So the easiest way to do this is by categories which is already a built-in function in blueprints. So you can just select any variable that you have like I have this can double jump variable right here and then under details on the right side here we have the category and then we have the default. As you can see if we click on this we have the default which is gonna just put it with the rest of them and then we have camera, character and input. But that's kind of a limited selection. Well luckily what we can do is create our own categories based on what we want. So for example, I have a bunch of variables from a health based system tutorial. So what if I want to all put them into one category our health system? Well, we can do that very simply. Instead of the default here, it's actually a typing box. So we can click on this, delete the default and just call it the health system. Just like that, we created a new category. So now I can select another variable, which is the max health. And if we click on default, we now have the health system category here. And I can just select that. And now it's in the same category. Then we can close and open the categories like this with a small arrow. So we just have a bunch of categories rather than 20 different variables for the same thing, basically. And we can put variables into the categories, not just with selecting them and then selecting the category itself. We can just drag it in and drag it under the category. And as you can see, now the walk speed is part of the health system. So just like this, you can sort your variables into different categories that you can customize and change how you want. And hopefully this will help you along in your project. So I hope you found this helpful. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. It helps out a lot. Thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.